they turned into automatic points down on the other end. And their shots, I mean, in that stretch there, not towards the end of the game when we really stalled out, but we were in the flow. I liked the shots. And I felt like um, we had some real near the rim that we need to finish. And then there's a corner three I know that Quan here Bay had that I, I thought was in. And then they come down and then that next possession I believe they were um, at the buzzer hit that. Not that that was a huge turning point um, in the game as we were struggling to kind of get back in it. Um, so we got to convert. I mean, take away our 0 for 9 and 3 in the second half, and I think we're 14 for 25. Um, we got to realize that we were 14 for 25 for the two. We got to go inside a little bit more, get to the rim, um, and uh, just take smarter shots there. So, uh, you know, when you have a weakness or you do something wrong against a great team, like this, mm-hmm. they drive the time you throw, and turn it for it, and they did it. And, um, we expected it, and, and you know, that was a good lesson for us. But um, we, we, we knew we were coming up here, we were wanting to win, we were trying to win, we really were. There was no intimidation or anything like that. We were planning on winning this one. So we're very disappointed. Um, and uh, But we also came up here to get a lesson. You know, and that 3 2 zone was a great lesson for us. The length of that 3 2 zone. And I told the kids, I said, I know it's easy for me in timeouts just to draw a play and say, screen this one roll down here or whatever, but it's a lot different out there for you because of their length. And, you know, they had length on us in every spot out there, and that really was a very effective defense and a great job coaching by them. Questions? Coach Merrill, when you're preparing for the Tennessee team with so many weapons, in preparation, where does a player like Tabor Spaney fall in to that, to your Well, assessment? we saw that next Michigan game, so she was pretty high on us. Oh, okay. We didn't think it because it seemed like she got a lot of open looks, but we had a ton of respect for her. She's just, she just she kills you. She hits great, timely shots and very good goals. And, uh, she, she played a special game, but I mean, she's going to have a special season. She's a great one. Coach, if you look at Fillmore, Tennessee last year, it was clear they were very vulnerable to pressure because of the problems of point guard. What has Ariel Massingale brought to them this season? Well, Shane was kind of done well with the pressure. It's a, a, a team that second in the nation steals last year. So she brings in a heck of a lot, and uh, obviously it freed up Simmons to score more if we let her uh, leak out and get some special plays behind the pressure, which kills us. So um, they're a very good team, and, and, and Arrow's a huge addition, a huge addition. Um, and, uh, you know, they're tough to beat. It's really Coach, you, you, cut it, you cut the lid, and you tied it at halftime, and you came out. You must have been back feeling pretty good at halftime.
this a great game to play in in terms of game film, learning? There's one thing to learn a lot. Yeah. So that can yeah. help coach that schedule this is the same for us. Um, so we'll be ready later on in the season. Um, we got a great lesson here. Like I said, we're definitely going to work on some zone.